we train our officers on the importance of how to engage with students and the difference between getting involved in school rule violations versus violations of the law. Today, state senators heard testimony from Clark County school leaders today. And this is some of the video that you're looking at right now about the district's use of force policy. Well, this comes after public outcry following the release of a video taken outside Durango High School. It shows a police a school police officer there taking down a student. Thank you so much for joining us here on Channel 13 Live at 6. I'm Joe Moeller. And I'm Trisha Keen. Our J1 Jong has the very latest tonight. The legislative hearing got heated at times with a number of state senators grilling CCSD Superintendent Jesus Jara and School District Chief of Police Henry Blackeye on use of force policy and school disciplinary actions. State lawmakers wanted to better understand what changes need to be made to ensure safer campuses in the Clark County School District. And I would implore you as you are seeking to revise your use of force policy that it's not just done internally. The Senate chamber heard hours of testimony from Clark County School District leaders Wednesday afternoon during a discussion about the district's use of force policy. At times, the exchange was heated. And then more havoc is being created in a school environment with no responsibility or accountability. The hearing comes following public outrage over a viral video showing a student getting slammed to the ground by a CCSD police officer outside Durango High School in February. In a statement released late Wednesday, Dr. Jara said many of the problems on campuses are coming from nearby neighborhoods and that school safety is as much a community issue as it is a district one. He said in part, quote, we are arresting adults on our campuses, adults who are coming onto our campuses and negatively engaging with our students. We rely on our entire community to ensure that students can attend school and receive an education in a healthy environment. School, school police work. officers testified um, before the state Senate committee that creating a safe learning environment is their main priority. And when there's a threat on campus, they say they're concerned about the security of students and staff. Everybody understands that feeling where your stomach is just in knots, mm -hmm. your heart starts to beat, um, and you are immediately more worried about the 800 to 3,000 students that are just trying to get an education at that time. Chief Black Eye testified about five officers have been disciplined for use of force in the past three years. He said the specifics of their disciplinary actions is not available to the public. In the Grand Sawyer Building, I'm Jaywan Jung.